everyone, this is Mark with MrHurricaneTracker.webs.com bringing you a second update for today, September 6, 2011. We are currently talking about Hurricane Katia. We also have a few other disturbances out there I'd like to talk about. First things first though, we'll get into Category 2 storm, Hurricane Katia, which is still moving northwest and away according to most spaghetti models as you see here on Google Earth, are moving it away from the United States. Now places up here in the East Coast need to be on watch for possible high surf and we'll continue to keep you posted if any updates come from the National Hurricane Center. But again, this is a Category 2 hurricane and uh, of course we'll keep watch on that. Right now we have a new tropical depression which is 14 and we'll have to watch this one real close because if you take a look at the path on the spaghetti models and on this hurricane tracker, it looks like this path will take a, sim a storm will take a similar path to Hurricane Irene. Now we're taking a look at a storm right here or disturbance that is trying to form out here right in between Hurricane Katia and Tropical Depression 14 which only has about a 20% chance of developing or less. And also we have a new Invest out here which is in the southern Gulf of Mexico, Invest 96L. Of course you take a look at the spaghetti models now that we are we have our name storm. The spaghetti models uh, do not do not look very organized and that is because right now the storm is currently very disorganized and we'll have to keep a close eye on it which right now it only has about a 30 percent chance of developing we're taking a look at a possible development right here which is about a 20 percent chance of developing into a tropical depression according to the national hurricane center out here in the eastern pacific and of course i'll bring in the information from mrhurricanetracker.webs.com Currently tracking Hurricane Katia at a Category 2 storm, advisory number 36 as of 11 p.m. Atlantic Standard Time. Maximum winds of our storm are at 90 knots or 105 miles per hour. Category 2 again. Minimum central pressures at 963 millibars, located at 28.1 degrees north and 67.2 degrees west. Movement is northwest at 8 knots or 9 miles per hour. We are tracking Tropical Depression 14. But before we get into that, again, I'll show you the path of Hurricane Katia, which is moving away from the U.S., which is very good news. And, of course, we're tracking tropical depression number 14. This is an 11 p.m. advisory. Max winds are at 30 knots at 35 miles per hour. Minimum central pressure, 1,008 millibars. Location at 11.6 degrees north and 38.1 degrees west. Movement is west at 60 knots or 18 miles per hour. So, real fast moving storm right now which will keep a watch on it because again like I said when you take a look at the path here I'm gonna bring that up now you'll see that this path is taking somewhat of a similar turn as Hurricane Irene did so we'll continue to keep you posted on that looking at the latest advisories from the National Hurricane Center go ahead and take a look at that there are some information on these storms right here such as the one in the Gulf of Mexico and the one between Katia and Tropical Depression 14 so stay tuned for the latest information and thank you very much for watching. Please rate, subscribe, and comment. And have a great day.